Modal verbs of deduction, advice and regret. Must, can't and infinitive. We use must when we have a good reason for thinking that something is true. It must be cold. They're wearing coats. Ali must be happy. He has just won a gold medal. Nadia lived in England for 20 years, so she must speak English well. I can't do what you want. You must be joking. Phaeton is not at work today. She must be ill. I'm sure he is a doctor. Equals he must be a doctor. The negative form for must is can't. He can't be Tamer's grandfather. He's too young. He can't be cold. He isn't wearing a jacket. He can't earn much money. He is so poor. They haven't lived here for very long. They can't know many people. I'm sure, he isn't the killer. Equals he can't be the killer. He can't be Tamer's grandfather. He's too young. Must have, can't have and past participle. The past form is must have and past participle, affirmative. Can't have and past participle, negative. My father must have taken the bus to work. His car is in the garage. You can't have finished that book already. You only bought it this morning. It must have been cold there. There is snow on the ground in the photo. The phone rang but I didn't hear it. I must have been asleep. I've lost one of my gloves. I must have dropped it somewhere. The streets are wet. It must have rained last night. He was here a minute ago. He can't have gone too far. They can't have had lunch. Their food is in the fridge. Sahar passed past me without saying hello. She can't have seen me. I think he didn't go to the country. Equals he can't have gone to the country. I think he recorded the song. Equals he must have recorded the song. Might, might not and infinitive. We use might, might not when we are not sure about something. I might not visit my friend this evening, I might stay at home. The tourist might be American because he has an English guidebook. My uncle might not return today. It's possible he will come. Equals he might come. Might have, might not have and past participle. The past form is might not have and past participle. Ali looks sad. He might not have passed the test. I can't find my book. I might have left it at home. I haven't seen Melissa for ages. She might have moved. I don't think they went out. Equals they might have gone out. Should, shouldn't and infinitive. Ought to, ought not to and infinitive. We use should, shouldn't or ought to, ought not to to give advice. You should not be ought not to be late for your lesson. In summer, tourists should wear a hat and ought not to sit in the sun. You should make a study plan to organize your work. Equals it is a good idea to make a study plan to organize your work. It is advisable to eat fresh food. Equals you ought to eat fresh food. You shouldn't leave your job. Equals if I were you. I wouldn't leave my job. Should have, shouldn't have and past participle. Ought to have, ought not to have and past participle. 
we use should have, shouldn't have and past participle or ought to have, ought not to have and past participle to express blame or regret about something that happened in the past. Should have, shouldn't have and past participle. Or ought to have, ought not to have and past participle. I shouldn't have got, ought not to have got up late. I shouldn't have been, ought not to have been angry with you. I'm sorry. You shouldn't have arrived late for your exam. I'm sorry. I ought to have come on time. 